Hello? Hello, is this Mrs General? Yes, yeah, speaking. Hi, is Mr Clark calling from the school? Tay's missed morning registration. I was just wondering if he was off sick today. No, he's definitely not sick. He left the school at a normal time today. That's odd. Have you heard anything from him since? Um, no, no, I've not. Should, should I be worried? I would try and contact him as soon as possible. I wouldn't worry just yet, because you know what he's like. Yes, sadly, I'm more than aware. Well, keep us posted if you hear anything, but I'll mark him as absent for the day. Thank you so much. I'm so sorry about this. Who was that on the phone? That was the school. Tay's missed morning registration. Leave it with me. I'll go find him. Thank you. And when you do, don't bring him back to the house because I will lay hands on him. Yo. Bruv, where are you right now? Uh, long story, yeah, but I just got back from France. You reckon you could scoop me from the station? France? How have you ended up in France? You left the house about two hours ago. I'll explain when I see you. Oh. Bonjour, Dad. Bonjour, you taking the piss. Explain yourself now. Right, so you know my boy T? Yes, I know your boy T. Well, his mum didn't make him a pat lunch today and he didn't have any money to go get a school dinner. Well, he can't go hungry all day. Exactly. So I asked him what he wanted. He said he wants a ham and cheese baguette, packet of crisps, an apple and some orange juice. That's a well-balanced lunch. So we went through his cupboards. There was no bread in the cupboards. Went to the fruit bowl. There was no fruit in the fruit bowl. So I said to him, look, brother, I'll lend you a tenner in it. But he said no, because you know what he's like. Yeah, that boy got too much pride, man. Literally. But he said, don't worry, I know a spot. So he ubers us to the train station. I'm thinking we're about to slide Sainsbury's. We're on the train. Next thing I hear the guy on the speaker system say, next stop, Paris. I suppose they do have the best baguettes. That's what I heard. But I said to T, yo, are you sure we're going to make it to France and back in time for school? And he tells me that by the time we get to France, it's still going to be 8am because they're two hours behind. Wait, wait, wait. So he thought you guys were time travelling? He must have done. But anyway, we try leaving the Paris train station. Border force stop us asking for passports. We're a couple of school kids. We ain't got passports on us. So we had to convince them that we're Jamaican special forces here on a secret blood clot mission. And what did they say? Well, they took us to the French Secret Service squad because they were hosting an international training day and wanted us to do a demonstration. But you guys aren't even special forces. Yeah, but they didn't know that. So we pull up to this seminar and we teach the whole French army how to disarm a nuclear warhead with a packet of ready salted crisps. Hey, yo, how on earth do you do that? Now, that's a story for another day, Dad. But after that, it was lunchtime. So we went to the all you can eat buffet, filled up bags full of croissants and baguettes, hopped on a train. And then that's when you called me. Right, so did you bring me back any food? I did, but the German shepherd that we adopted out there had the munchies and ate all the leftovers. Well, at least it didn't go to waste. Straight up, but I do have that Domino's link in my bio so you can get a free pizza if you're still hungry, but what? Am I in trouble? Yeah, you're pretty fucked to be real. No worries.